Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Sara and in today's video I want to give you some outfit ideas for summer by showing you how to style a pair of super wide-legged and flowy trousers. And I will be styling these in a lot of different styles and aesthetics so hopefully you will be able to find an outfit that you like regardless of what your personal style is and if you also do enjoy styling videos and watching thrift hauls and vintage fashion then make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below and also give this video a thumbs up and now let's jump straight on into the first outfit so this is my take on the coastal grandma style that has been quite popular on the internet for the past... I feel like I've been seeing it for the past month at least. And I decided to pair the trousers with just a simple white and blue button-up, a bit oversized, very relaxed, and I chose to tuck it in to give my waist some definition. And then because I have been seeing it in a lot of pictures on Instagram and on Pinterest, I took a little cable knit jumper and just tied it around my shoulders. And for shoes I decided to go for a pair of white sneakers. And I think this type of outfit is perfect for those summer days when you want to cover up and protect your skin so that you don't have to expose yourself to the sun so much. This is an outfit that I personally think is a lot of fun but at the same time it is so relaxed and comfortable and just perfect for those really warm days because I've paired the very flowy trousers with an oversized short sleeved shirt with a very funky floral print and to be honest I think all of you have some sort of short sleeved shirt in some pattern or another so for this outfit I really do encourage you to have a look through your wardrobe and see which tops you can pull out that you already have and if not they are super easy to find at the thrift store if you want to have a funky short sleeve top like this one. To keep the outfit relaxed and perfect for summer I also added just a small little straw bag that could hold like your phone and uh, some sunglasses. And for shoes I have a pair that they look like Birkenstocks, they are not Birkenstocks, they are some other brand but then you get the idea of what type of shoe I think works really well with this outfit. Very simple just slip-ons and yeah just a simple relaxed yet stylish outfit. I realise that the majority of us will be spending quite a large part of our summer working so I thought that I would try to style the trousers for a more office appropriate look and to be honest I love how this outfit turned out. I think it is very stylish and sophisticated but at the same time with the really flowy trousers it does give that summer nod. So with the trousers I'm wearing just a very simple like white little um, top and you can't really see a lot of it because I'm wearing a light grey blazer over and because the blazer is such a light colour I do think that it works for summer as well. And with the button up blazer you can't really see where the top end and the trousers start so it almost gives the illusion that you're wearing a jumpsuit and I just think that it looks really cool together. When it comes to bags and shoes I just brought out a little black handbag very like simple and sophisticated and for shoes I brought out a pair of loafers because I think that is a great alternative if you are working in an office. I also want to add that if you are enjoying this video so far and you are finding it helpful then make sure that you give it a thumbs up, I really appreciate it, and also hit that subscribe button down below if you want to see more of my videos. And while we are on the topic of blazers I also wanted to show you this outfit and it's the same as the previous one but I've switched out the quite structured grey blazer for a very funky one with a very fun print. Now this may not be appropriate for the office for all of you but I do think that it makes for a great like going out in the evening outfit. Very sleek and stylish but at the same time very comfortable and um, yeah if you have a fun blazer then I think it would work really well with a pair of trousers like this so um, I'm just adding this one into the mix so that you can get some more ideas. And uh, because I do have some black details in the blazer, I decided to just keep the same bag and shoes, 
but because the blazer has a fun pattern it does give off a completely different vibe. And also if you like this blazer then it is, as of filming today, available on my Depop so if you like it then you can go and snatch it up. I am at Just Like Sarah over there as well and I will leave a link to my Depop down below. This is how I would style the trousers if I was wearing them to a beach day. So I've just popped on a bikini top in a funky colour. If you want to wear a full on swimsuit under that would work just as well. That's just up to your personal preference. And then I also added just a large tote bag so that I can bring everything that I need to the beach. My uh, towel, extra sunscreen, a bottle of water. It will work really well with a tote. And then to protect my head and face from the sun, I also added a huge sun hat. Um, to be honest, I think the sun hat would work with a lot of the outfits in this video, but I decided to bring it out for this one. And yeah, this is just a perfect, you know, casual, relaxed way to wear the funky trousers to the beach. And also because I am planning to be on the beach, I'm not adding any shoes because sand in your shoes is one of the worst things ever so no shoes for this one. Now I love adding a vintage vibe to my outfits and I think this outfit is the perfect like retro look because I've paired the trousers with a knitted a very colourful little vest which I think is super cute. It's cropped and works perfectly with the trousers. And then because the top is so vibrant I decided to add a little vintage bag in a black leather and I just thought that it helped balance out the outfit. And to match in with the bag I also opted for a pair of black loafers that are very similar in style and colour to the bag and together with the vest I just thought that it really was bringing those vintage and retro vibes. And this is a great idea if you are someone who loves wearing sweater vests then I do recommend to try to bring them out during the summer as well and not only keep them for layering in the winter. So have a peek through your wardrobe and see what you can use. I realise that not everyone is a fan of the high-waisted and crop top style and proportions of an outfit, so for this one I decided to go with a top that is a lot longer. Uh, this is a linen button-up shirt but it has no sleeves, so perfect for a warm summer day. And by adding a top that is a little bit longer and not tucking it in, you do create a more relaxed and different silhouette compared to if you were wearing like a short shirt. And I really do like how this looks together with the flowy trousers because the entire outfit looks very relaxed but sophisticated at the same time. And because we were already working in a very neutral colour palette, I also added a straw belt in a beige brown tone and I added a pair of brown gladiator sandals. And by doing this, I kept the entire outfit very neutral, which is something that I really love in an outfit. I wanted to show you how I would wear these trousers if I was going out to dinner for the evening or perhaps I was going to a party or event. And I think these types of trousers are perfect for that too. So in this outfit, I paired the trousers with just a very simple black lace cami because I do love a good pairing of black and white. And then to help tie it in at the waist, I did add this quite wide leather belt with a big buckle. And then even though the trousers do have pockets, I do like to be hands-free if I'm out and about. So I added just a simple little black handbag, very sleek and sophisticated. And yeah, I just thought that this was a super fun party outfit. When it comes to shoes, I know exactly what type of shoes I would wear. Sadly, I do have a pair, but I, I can't walk in them. But So I'm currently selling them on my Depop. They look like this. And if you do like the style of them, like I said, they are on my Depop. They are in a size U41. Yeah, 41. Um, if that's your size, it's about a UK seven and a half. And I think that a black strappy sandal like that would be absolutely perfect with this look to tie in the black from the cami and the belt and uh, also the bag. And yeah, great party outfit. So those were all of the outfits that I put together for you today. I would love to know which one was your favorite. So let me know in the comments down below. 
and if you have not already done so then make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and that you hit the subscribe button down below because I post new videos about thrifting, styling secondhand and vintage fashion every Friday and it would be super fun if you came and joined us. So I will see you in my next video and until then take care of each other and I'll see you soon. Bye!